Mike Gosford set the jump. Ready racing now. One of the smartest out towards the outside was uh, the favourite, was uh, being good. A couple falling over there and Doop Hooligans run back the other way. Out of the straight, being good the leader. In second place still in crunch. A long way back then into third place Gary's Dream and then came Stud Gurry followed by Ty Penn's time and then came Laurie's Tim Tan and uh, they're just trying to pick up Doop Hooligan here at the top of the straight. Coming to the turn, being good the leader is nicely clear and being good down to the line is going to bolt in. In uh, second place still in crunch Gary's Dream and then came Stud Gary, followed by Ty Penn's time. Now here comes Laurie's Tim Tan and Doo-Wop Hooligan. He took a heavy tumble and he was absolutely scared out of his uh, mind. He was up there. The, the, the boys just couldn't pick him up. But just as they turned the corner, just prior to turning the corner, he just leapt the outside fence and he headed towards the kennels. And the main thing, he seems to be OK. And so too did the other greyhound that fell, which was uh, Laurie's Tim Tam. All right, sixth the winner being good. My magic's by Elizabeth Royal, owned and trained by Jane Carruthers. One still in crunch second. He's a felon kibble cruncher, Darren Sultana. And number two, Gary's Dream. My oh, Jim goes up, Gary's Lady for Warren Slade. Six, one, and two will be the numbers. It was 898, 1297, and a very smart run of 3556. Promising youngster by Magic Spite out of Elizabeth Royal. Fourth and number three, and that was State Gary. Six, one, two, and three. Eleven and three quarter lengths. Margin between second and third was a half a length. Yeah, gee, when they fall and they get terribly frightened, and there was no one in the world they were going to catch that dog. He was absolutely petrified to do up hurling. But anyway, no damage done, and they seem to be okay, and that's the main thing.